Josh said here, Full Arty Photography, and today I'm going to talk about slow motion and the 90D. Um, before I start ranting about whatever, I'm just going to show you a video that I made on the weekend. I was just hanging out with my friend, drinking beer, and I'm like, can I make this interesting with slow motion? So I made a kind of little tiny music video, and uh, here, go to it. Really, it's just a, a video of my friend uh, doing nothing. And it's interesting what slow motion can do because it can really make the mundane interesting. Slow motion is used so often now in movies, you know, for action, action scenes. It, it helps show uh, things that you can't normally see at normal speed, sort of ex accents things. It's just a way of speed ramping and sort of contrasting normal speed, right? So when you see something normal and then all of a sudden you slow it down in an action scene, it sort of makes it a little bit more epic, right? It sort of zooms into the details, whether it's like blood splatter or just someone getting knocked in the head, doing a flip. That's, you know, that's what slow motion is used for. Or those are things that it's used for. There's lots of things you can use it for or not use it for. It's up to you. I suppose it's about storytelling. The things that you don't normally think about when you slow them down, you see them, you see a little detail. It helps enhance emotion sometimes, you know. Uh, if you just put the camera on a normal speed and show somebody's face, it's a lot different than when you slow it down. You can actually see the reaction just in more detail. Naturally, slow motion, like any tool used in, in filmmaking, is you need to use it for a purpose. Um, but, you know, sometimes you don't. You can just film things in slow motion and they look a lot cooler than they normally do. What I like about the 90D is that, you know, I have 1080p in slow motion, which I didn't have before. So that's essentially why, uh, an another reason why I bought the 90D was really just to have slow motion at 1080p. You know, a little bit of full HD slowness, you know, can help your, your films look a little more, a little bit more interesting, you know. I mean, you gotta have an idea, of course, before you just start shooting everything in slow motion. However, pretty much any movement in slow motion looks a lot cooler in slow motion, you know. But uh, naturally, you're not gonna film an entire film with in slow motion, and you know, maybe, maybe you could. You know, music videos can be done entirely in slow motion, like I did this little tiny uh, weekly video here. I made this little slow motion film of my friend doing pretty much nothing. And it looks a bit more interesting than nothing, I think. But the effect is there. It looks interesting. And I hope you like it. I hope you enjoyed it. Maybe you want the 90D. If you do, that's cool. But don't make it because I told you to do. I'm just trying to show you what it's capable of. Um, I did it in low light. A 24 millimeter Sigma Art Lens. It's my go-to lens, really. And especially on the crop sensor. On the APS-C, it's like 38. It's kind of film quality-esque um, kind of angle, which I like. Um, so I hope you liked it. I hope you enjoyed this video. I keep making more videos, but uh, remember to like, share, comment, and subscribe. It helps out, and uh, I'll continue to, uh, you know, try to get a weekly video in here. <laughs> Cheers, Josh said.